We are checking in once again with Jessica Jewell and Jeff Hanowich for a final look at the tornado activity in Lynchburg tonight. They are there live. Uh, they uh, have, have been there, what, I guess for uh, a couple of hours now. So guys, uh, what are you seeing and what do you expect we'll see when the sun comes up? It's going to be scary to see what we see when the sun comes up because if we're seeing this kind of damage in the dark, I can only imagine what it's going to look like when we get some daylight. We want to show you some of the damage we didn't get to show you earlier. This is still off of Timberlake Road here. This is behind that Starbucks and the urgent care. We talked about the flip truck we saw. Well, look at this tractor trailer bed completely turned over on its side and all this debris scattered out here. A lot of damage and like we said, it's going to be scary to see what the daylight brings, right, and Jeff? Just to give you an idea of where we are, uh, we are uh, right behind the Starbucks that we were talking about on air for several minutes uh, earlier tonight. Uh, you know, when you are doing storm coverage and you're talking about roads, and you're, you're mentioning Timberlake Road over and over and over again, then you arrive on Timberlake Road and you see the damage that is all over the place, unfortunately, on this road. It's completely surreal. Uh, and, you know, we've had Dublin. We've had Evergreen. Uh, as Jessica said, I don't even want to fathom what the light of day is going to show, uh, not only in Danville, but in and around Forest, in and around Lynchburg, in the southern parts of Amherst County. Uh, at nighttime, you can see a lot of damage, and it's dark. When the light comes up, we'll see what it looks like. But uh, um, I'm, like you said, I think scared is a good word to describe our feelings right now. Uh, the damage that we've seen along Timberlake Road is widespread. Uh, the, the Burger King, lots of damage. The Starbucks, lots of damage. The, the Med Express, that's where we were when we started out the show. Uh, the Med Express is gone. And, you know, is this an EF1? Could it be an EF2? Uh, for instance, uh, the, the uh, Appomattox tornado was a, a strong tornado. And the damage here appears to be as bad as what we saw in Appomattox County, Jessica. And we talked about what the light of day is going to bring. We will have crews here to see all that damage. We're going to have crews in all of these hard hit areas. We'll have coverage starting tomorrow morning on Virginia Today starting at 5 a.m.